Hello boys and girls. So I have a lot to do today. I'm going to read you a story. Um, our essential question this week is what places do you go during the week? And so I was thinking of if you were to go on a walk and some of the things you might see on a walk during the week. So the title of this story is I Went Walking. It's written by Sue Williams, illustrated by Julie Vivas. So we're going to it's a really big book, so just bear with me. So here's our title page again. I went walking right here. And I'm going to pull it like this so you can see both sides. And I'm going to do a little bit of reading and a little bit of singing. And I need you to be singing with me. Okay, so here's the first part. It goes, I went walking. Your turn. I went walking. And then I'll, I'll sing first and then your turn. What did you see? Your turn. What did you see? And there's this side and then this side. I saw a black cat looking at me. Your turn. I saw a black cat looking at me. Okay, so here we go again. I went walking, your turn. I went walking. What did you see? Your turn. What did you see? And it says, I saw a brown horse looking at me. Your turn. I saw a brown horse looking at me. And there's the brown horse. Okay, again, I went walking, I went walking. What did you see? Your turn. What did you see? And then, you go on this side first. I saw a red cow looking at me. Ready? I saw a red cow looking at me. And there's the red cow. Okay, so you guys ready to sing it? You guys know how it goes. Ready? With me. I went walking. I went walking. What did you see? What did you see? Do you see something right there? What do you think it's going to be? I think you're right. I saw a green duck looking at me. Your turn. I saw a green duck looking at me. And there's the green duck. Okay, you guys know how it goes now. Ready? I went walking. I went walking. Sing it with me. What did you see? What did you see? And we see a lot of words that we know. We know that word and we know the word I. Okay, so are you ready to sing? What did they see right here? I saw a pink pig looking at me. And there's our pink pig. Okay, ready? I went walking. I went walking. What did you see? Again, what did you see? Okay, you guys see what it is? It's going to be a yellow dog. You ready to sing it? I saw a yellow dog looking at me. And there's our yellow dog. Okay, one more time. I need you guys to sing it with me. You know these words. I went walking. I went walking. What did you see? What did you see? And then it's a little different, the ending. And the ending says, I saw a lot of animals following me. Ready? I saw a lot of animals following me. And I think that's the last page. Yes, it is. One of my favorite stories. Okay, so I'm going to do a little bit of reviewing. And these are the id family words. Remember that if the middle and ending sound and word is the same, it's going to rhyme. So not only are these words going to have id at the middle and ending, it's also, they're also going to rhyme together. So let me do the beginning sound with a different color. So I'm going to make these into a word. Okay. So here's the first word, and this is id. Can you say id? Okay, so I'm going to put a beginning sound. It's a D. Okay, so we can use our, our parts and put it together. So we can say d, id, 
did. We can also go like this, d, id, and did. So that's the word did. What did you see? We had that word in the story. What did you see? Okay, so here's another word. And this is going to be a K. So we're gonna do the sound of the K first. And let's, can you do it with me? So we're gonna use like this and like this. Get ready with your hands. So we're gonna do the K here on the side. K, and then id, kid. What was the first one? Did, kid. You see how they kind of sound the same? They rhyme together. Okay, so now I'm going to put an R. R says R, R. So we're going to use our parts together. So we're going to do R, ID, RID. So if you get rid of something, it's going to go away. So what do we have? We have DID, KID, RID. And one more, we're going to do an H. So when H says, okay, so get your hands ready to do it with me. Ready? H. Id, hid. If we hid, it's, it's like hiding, right? Okay, so now I'm going to review. My alpha friend is Kelly Cat, right? So let's do Kelly Cat again. Kelly Cat, k, k, k. do it with me. Kelly cat, C C C. Kelly cat, k, k, k. this side. Kelly cat, C C C. And what sound does the C say? K. Do it with me. The C says K. The C says K. Every letter makes a sound. The C says K. And you know what's really funny? Is one of my students said, "You know what, Mrs. Ballas? When we make the sound of the C, it almost sounds like we're." coughing. So let's go like this. It does sound like I'm coughing, right? Okay, so this is our Cali cat. I'm going to show you some pictures that start with the C. This is a camera. So if I ask you what is the first sound in camera, you're just going to say the k -k sound. Just one time you're going to say k. I'm going to be testing you really soon on beginning sounds. So camera. Let's do camera. Camera starts with C. K, k, k. Make sure you're doing this with me. Okay, I have another picture. What is that? You're right, it's a comb. Can you say comb with me? Comb. What is the first sound you hear in comb? K, you hear it? Okay, so let's do comb. Ready? Do it with me. Comb starts with C. Okay, let me get some ones that I haven't had. So our sound spelling card is a camel. So what is the first sound in camel? Can you do it with me? K. There's the C at the beginning of camel. Let's do camel. That's a real camel. Ready? Camel starts with C. K, k, k. Oh my goodness. And this is a cowboy. What is the first sound you hear in cowboy? Can you say it? K, k. Right there. Let's do cowboy. Cowboy starts with C. 